And happening tonight, the impeachment probe was on the mind of Senator Bernie Sanders, the Democratic presidential candidate in Chicago tonight, attending a union rally. Chicago teachers are voting on whether to authorize a strike next month. NBC5's Dick Johnson is live at CTU headquarters right now, where the rally wrapped up just a short time ago. Dick? Ellison Senator Sanders' response to news of the impeachment effort was that he called for it himself three months ago. His campaign manager added to that this evening, saying it is time to build a case so the public understands, but he said not lose sight of the campaign going on to defeat the president in the next election. Here in Chicago tonight, Senator Sanders avoided the topic of impeachment, focusing solely on supporting Chicago teachers and their fight. Senator Bernie Sanders not only delivered the energy CTU wants for its members to authorize a strike, but the rhetoric, too. Negotiate a good faith contract that is just, that is fair, that treats the teachers and staff in this city with the respect and dignity that they deserve. Actor John Cusack preceded him. I think in the richest country in the world, Two teachers living together should not have to take a vow of poverty to educate our kids. But it's not star power that rallies this crowd most. It's the stories of what they believe they need to effectively teach. When I started this school year with 40 kindergarten students, I'll be honest, I panicked. Mayor Lightfoot has made what she believed was a generous proposal, pledging to even sit down at the bargaining table if need be. CTU has said no. I, it, it's not a surprise to me that um, Democratic contenders for the presidency support working families and support teachers. So do I. It's part of who we are as Democrats. Teachers have until Thursday to authorize a strike. The earliest strike date would be October 7th. Live at the CTU Union headquarters on the west side, Dick Johnson, NBC5 News. Dick, thank you.